How y'all doing fam? So today we're gonna clean some gutters. Yes, we're gonna get a little bit dirty. We're gonna go and we're gonna go vertical and we're gonna clean some gutters. So let's go. Grow, eco neighbor. Grow, 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 eco neighbor. Grow, 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 eco neighbor. Grow, 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 grow eco neighbor. Hey everyone. Today I want to work on these gutters behind me. If you notice, you see all of that debris all up in those gutters. So today I'm going to show you how I clean my gutters. And I just want you to be safe and just take the time and then relax and watch. Items that I'll be using. I'll be using some gloves uh, to actually take the debris out of the gutter. I will be using this blower. I have a gas blower. If you don't have one, that's not a problem. If you want to do something uh, a little bit more uh, where you don't have to use uh, actual gas, you can use this. This one is better because it's lightweight and it's small. And when you're up on a ladder, you want to be very careful that you don't have anything heavy like this unless you're used to using it. Um, this right here is very light and it's, and it's small. So you can kind of go up on the ladder and like I said I can hold this up with my pinky but these gas they will be a whole lot heavier and if you're not used to it I recommend going with something a little bit lighter than this but just keep in mind uh, if you do use this you're gonna have cords and you have to be extremely careful if you're going up on the ladder with um, cords uh, another thing that I'll be using is a water hose uh, once we clean everything out I'm just gonna rinse uh, the downspouts and rinse it out and uh, this will allow me to check it and make sure, um, look for leaks as well as any type of clog on the, and let me show you where on the downspouts. So I'm gonna let rainwater, I'm, I'm gonna let the water hose uh, come through here and just to make sure it's not clogged up here. So without further ado, let's get started. about setting up your ladder is you see these feet these feet must be firmly planted down this part right here must touch the ground so ensure that this part is touching the ground on these feet so we're gonna go ahead and adjust the ladder just simply raise it up that side is taken care of let's go to the other side And then you want to make it as level as possible. You want the feet firmly. This is very important and key. You want it pretty much level with the ground, okay? So if you got a little bumps, a little healy, just make sure you press it in. Make sure it's firmly uh, pressed in the ground. Another thing with the ladder, uh, look, I want you to look at this angle. See this slight angle right here? You want to really take your time and make sure you got just a slight angle. You don't want it too close up against it. So let me show you where you don't want it. When you're setting up your ladder, you don't want to be vertical like that. You don't want to be straight up like that. You want a slight incline. You want a slight incline. So let's step back and take a look at that. You want a nice slight incline with your ladder. That's important. Another thing is this one it extends so it goes beyond this part so make sure this is firmly secured right here make sure it's open and it's secured this locks it and assures it from sliding up and down on both sides so make sure this is firmly secured and then with this angle we're pretty much ready another thing what you want to do I'm gonna take you up just a little bit further see you want it you don't want it up against the gutter you wouldn't want it like that. And then you don't want it like on the edge or anything like that. See how that is like that? You don't want that like that. You want it firmly up against stabi uh, the stability of the house. You want it nice and stable. You want it nice and stable against the house. So that incline, 
feet. Make sure if you move it, check your feet again because the feet will move. Get the feet nice and adjust it. And then you want to be straight. You don't want it like, like you wouldn't want it sideways off to the side like this. You want it straight too. You want the ladder as straight as possible. Straight as possible. So now let's let's take it let's take it higher. Let's take it higher. So this is what we're tackling right here. The rainwater comes from that incline and then it goes down here to our gutter space. And look at that mess right there. With all these leaves been falling. This can be a problem, especially as we approach the beginning of the spring, we're gonna get a lot of rain. So we gotta get all of this stuff out, out of the gutters. And that way we can be prepared and ready for all of this rain because the leaves are pretty much done with their dropping for this year. And it's January. So in our preparation for this spring, we're gonna clean this out. And then we're going to have it nice and clean and ready to uh, manage our rainfall. So let's get started. Okay, here we go. Okay, after I have completely taken all the debris out by hand, this is what it looks like. Will it work? Yeah, it'll work. But hey, I gotta do, I gotta take it, make sure I wanna rinse all of this through and I wanna rinse all of this out. So due to it being so wet, I won't have to use my blower. So I can skip that one step and now I'm just gonna use my water hose. You got adjustable. I like to put it on the jet. The jet works much better. And what I do is I just go up and down and I rinse it out. And once I work my way all the way down, that's it. It's just that simple. It's just that easy. Just that easy, y'all. Just remember, be careful. Look out for power lines. Don't climb if you're unsure. If you have, just make sure you just be careful. It's best to have someone with you holding the ladder uh, while you're doing this. And someone there at the house, they know you up on the ladder. Um, so they can check on you periodically as well. So. Be safe, and I'm just gonna finish this up. So Y'all be well. You have it, people. It's just that simple, but I'm begging you, please be safe, um, be careful, and try not to do this by yourself. Um, my family is here. They know I'm up on the ladder. Make sure you be safe, and if you're unsure about doing it, don't try to tackle this project because there are risks, and, but, if you feel like you can do this and you're used to using ladders, try it. Um, take a look at your your gutters. I, that's, that's the whole point of this video. I just want you to take a look at your gutters, take a look and make sure they're not clogged. If they are, you may want to call a professional to do it, consult a professional. But if you're pretty comfortable, you're pretty cool with it, hey, I just want to kind of remind you, you know, April showers are getting ready to come in there. So, Make sure you prepare your gutters and make sure you keep stay safe and make sure you always, always, always keep on growing. Grow.